I'm Batman. I like your outfit. There's a gun in black. A good death is its own reward. My reward would be you taking off. Stay away from him, Ursa. You won't hurt my fellow Justice League member. Please make it happen, Warner Brothers. I told you, I am not Ursa. I am Feor with an F, like... You! Do you want super cheap prices for your Superman figures? Well, go to BigBadToysStore.com. They're super. Love you, kids. It's time for your big review. What up, big kids? Here's your big review of the Man of Steel Movie Masters Feora action figure. So here we got the first female figure from the Man of Steel Movie Masters line. Maybe we'll get a little slain. Please, Mattel. Please, please. But um, you can see the head sculpt. It is pretty good. Um. Parts of it, sometimes it looks very pretty with the eyes and lips, and some of it kind of looks a little mannish. I know uh, Arnie, um, I forget the actress that plays her, but she uh, she is really a pretty actress and a really strong, you know, you know, sexy woman. And some angles portrays that, and some, you know, it, it's like, yeah, like when you turn it, ooh, sexy, and then turn, ooh, a little man. So. And the head sculpt is a mixed bag, but the other, everything else is awesome. The armor, just like the armored Zod, is fantastic in paint abs and sculpting. It looks so freaking cool, and I love her, just like Zod. It's like a dirty cape, you know, with like different patterns and ripples and everything. You can see her uh, butt right there, and the belt looks amazing. And um, she even has her sword little knife thing which isn't detachable I wish that it was an actual accessory you can use but yeah you can see the sculpt on here just pretty awesome Mattel did a fantastic job articulation Feora's head can um, move left right the collar does hinder it from fully rotating it only goes up that much and it does go down so not too much head articulation the arms um, the armor is on these pliable pieces so you can actually rotate it if you kind of move it but it will go up at least this much uh, before it hits it and same with this one uh, like I said they um, they're not like Zod where they're attached to the arm, so that's only a bad part. They do go in and out, rotate at the bicep, bend at the elbow, rotate at the wrist. Uh, she does have waist articulation that fully rotates, which is great. Her legs go forward really good and not really back at all, sadly. Uh, she does have upper uh, leg articulation, but because of the point, it's a little, uh, well, it's not pointless, but yeah, it's just a little t right above the knee joint, which bends. And her ankles pivot forward and back, but no ankle pivot side to side. The only accessory Feora comes with is a stand. It would be nice if Mattel included like her sword or her helmet, but still, it's uh, I do like these stands. You will not win. For every human you save, we will kill a million more. Okay, if you must kill anyone, please make sure it's the cast of the Jersey Shore and keep it up with the Kardashians. Justin Bieber, Cast of Twilight, and also it, pretty much anyone that's on a reality show on E, except Joe McHale on the soup. He's awesome. Size comparison time. So here you can see Feor is pretty shorter than other figures in the Movie Masters line. Uh, definitely shorter than Superman and Zod, and even shorter than uh, the Dark Knight Rises Movie Masters Catwoman. And you can see uh, compared to the DC Universe Classics New 52 Superman. Super excited for Man of Steel. I think uh, Feora might be a standout character in the movie from what I'm seeing. Uh, she looks very intense and very awesome. And Mattel really brought, uh, did a great job bringing out that in the figure. Uh, the head sculpt isn't as good as, say, um, Superman or Zod's, but it is better than, like, jor So, um, and like I said, from certain angles, it looks really uh, better than others, but the rest of the figure, the armor, is pretty awesome. And I do wish it, it came with a few more accessories, but, you know, it's been standard with, like, the first wave of figures that only came out of the sand. Uh, you can get this uh, for around 15 17 bucks. Uh, I know, I think Big Bad Toy Store has it. You can check them out. Um, if you're able to find this in retail, um, definitely get it because she's starting to show up. And like I said, she goes really well with the other Movie Master figures, especially with Zod. And I highly recommend her. For more geek news, reviews, podcasts, and more, go to bkbn.net. I'm Sean Long, member of Celebrate Your Nerdum in a big way. Go to bkbn.net! Go to bkbn.net! There's something I need to tell you. What is it, my wife? You are dad. Daddy. What the f How in Zod's name did this happen? Oh, you remember that one day in the Phantom Zone when, you know, I was 
kneeling before your rod. Oh my god, this feels like a CW soap opera.